For the second year in a row, cruise ships will not dock in the port of Astoria because of COVID-19. Fox 12's Bridget Chavez tells us how communities along the coast are dealing with the loss of revenue. The port of Astoria expected 37 ships to dock here in 2020, but those were canceled because of the pandemic. And this year they were hopeful that the 29 ships on the schedule would come through. But the Delta variant has changed all of that. If you would have talked to me a few months ago back in, in May or June, uh, we were fairly confident at that point that by the end of 2021, we would be getting cruise vessels in here. And Will Issam is the executive director of the Port of Astoria and tells me the economic impact is being felt all around the region. So in a given year, the, the direct revenue to the port is in the ballpark of a million to a million five. But that's just a small piece of the, the economic benefit uh, as, as those folks, when they come to town, uh, are also visiting many of the businesses and tourist destinations that we have in, in the region. Make our tuna fish sandwiches out of this. At Hurricane Ron's co-owner, Ron Neva, tells me since last year, they've taken about a $40,000 hit from this. They buy from the bigger box stores, the bigger companies, but when the bigger companies kind of don't deliver because of COVID, usually, they come to us and they'll fill their order here. Like with salmon or tuna or whatever. But despite that loss, he says they've still managed to stay afloat. So many places are closed. Mm -hmm. So the ones that chose to be open pretty much killed it. Neva says in his 22 years in business, 2020 was the first year cruise ships didn't dock here. And he hopes they'll return next year. Last year, I thought it was a good idea. This year, I'm not so sure. I think things are opening up, and I'm not a fear monger. I think if you're really afraid, don't go out. <laughs> and if you're willing to take a chance and get on a cruise ship, go for it. The port is expecting 37 ships for 2022, but again, there's no guarantee that that will happen. In Astoria, Bridget Chavez, Fox 12 Oregon.